This episode of Batwoman has themes dealing with mental illness, such as the disorder body dysmorphia and scenes with self-harm. If you or someone you know struggles with this illness, then this episode may not be the episode to watch for you. And if you need any extra help or are looking to get some extra help, you can go to the links down below in the description for more information. Enjoy the reaction. The following reaction has been rated LV, low volume suggested, because some material may not be suitable for ears and those headphone users watching this reaction. You have been warned. What's up, Dynamite? This is Kennedy from Dynamic Reactions, and we are here for Batwoman Season 1, Episode 14, Grinning from Ear to Ear. Last episode, um, we got rid of our um, Earth-99 Alice. Alice woke up. She was mad at Kate for not choosing her. For Earth 90 over Earth 99 Alice basically and so now here we are Alice is out leaking from mouse she already knows that um the caterpillar as she calls mouse's dad has probably taken him hostage and now we're dealing with a little girl that cuts people's faces off their heads so <laughs> uh, I'm really excited to see what happens this episode and uh yeah without further ado let's jump into it full reactions on patreon if you're watching this on patreon hi hello because you got it earlier than everybody else and it's a full reaction so aren't you lucky but anyways let's get into it <laughs> duella that's pretty. <coughs> First, apply your base and rub it all around. Then follow your hollow to shave off the pounds. Oh, Fine that's... line your lips to hide that off-putting frown. That's really unhealthy. Okay. Oh god. She has um body dysmorphia. Ah, okay, it makes sense now. Oh my god. Okay, I'm going to have to put a trigger warning on this episode. Which is fine. Oh my, oh my gosh. Mentally deranged leader? Girl, what did you That's expect, Chili? Tiny little blurb below the fold. I survived captivity <coughs> for eleven years. Maybe Maybe if you had survived captivity and made what? some Don't good out of yourself, it would have been different, but Ah, oh, this is so annoying. Oh, this girl, ADA. Uncle Harvey. Did I hear that correct? How did you get her name? Huh? Bat As in Two Face? Bat sources be of the tall. Oh shoot! Dang! Oh god, we're so screwed. This is so screwed. This is so worse. This is worse than Barry Allen. Oh my god. We are being so reckless with this secret identity right now. I can't. I see when I look at Ron Whoa. Oh my god. Oh god, Kate, please hurry up. Please hurry.
Good catch. Oh. We're finally reaching the pinnacle. She's gonna come out of the closet. Alice? An ally. You mm -hmm. and I were both wronged by the same man. He took my adolescence. <coughs> Just like you took your smile. I will get revenge for both of us. But first, I'm gonna need a little something from you. Hmm? Lord, have mercy. I'm finally perfect. I shouldn't be here, Tuella. Sorry. You got the wrong girl. <gasps> oh! No. No, you're dead. I'm Alice is ruthless as heck! Oh, oh my god! god. You like taking things from children, don't you? Well, we're all grown up now. Oh my god, I got chills. I'm here for a little payback. I oh wow. So I hope one day that you feel the same way about me. That's a nice subtle way at hinting that you know Mary. This is why I love her. Wow. I love that little chipmunk so much. She's such a good person. Can't fight those big people, can ya? Come on, baby, you, you can do it. For you to drop the act and face. She is such a good actress. I see his face every night as I go to sleep and every morning as I wake and sometimes when I close my eyes and shake too long. If you're gonna kill me, do it. Kill me. Get it over with. They mustn't speak. I would never kill you. At least not with these nimble little fingers. What do you want? I grab your mouse. Surely you have him and I want him. So where is he? <laughs> Why is that so funny? I will tell you where you can find your precious mouse. Uh-uh, what'd he do? What is happening? <gasps> no! Oh my god, I know it! Oh my god! Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. A toxin he wanted to unleash my greatest fears. You'll never find out where Alice is being tortured. No! Imagine the darkness she has inside of her. What? That woman. Okay. Holy crap. Okay. I said to myself when he was putting the mask on him, I was like, there is only one gas in the world of Batman that I know of. And holy oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Mouse is scarecrow. That is a twist I did not see coming. And I'm shook. I'm heavily shook. But I guess he's like Scarecrow 2.0, I suppose, maybe? Oh my god, where did he get the fear toxin?
Jackson. Unless we're like saying that Scarecrow never existed in Bruce's version of this situation, in Bruce's version of Gotham, like this crisis situation. Unless we're saying now that Mouse is post-crisis Scarecrow, which we could totally go that route. Oh my God. Oh my God, I can't wait for next week. I feel like this is definitely gonna be the turning point for Alice that she needs because I can feel her having a shift in character because seeing how she acted with Cartwright and um, seeing how vulnerable she became, her personality just kind of switched. She was still trying to keep her guard up, but it was still quite, quite shaky, so. I'm really excited to see what happens next. Thanks for watching with me. Leave a comment, leave a like, leave a subscribe. Tell me your thoughts. I want to know how you feel about this twist. The twists just keep coming, bro. Oh my God. And of course, I'm happy Sophie finally came out to her mom, even though it hurt a ton. And this was a great way to address body dysmorphia for those people who aren't familiar with it with this villain but i would definitely have to put a trigger warning at the beginning of this video because that can be triggering for some but uh yeah i'll see you guys on the next one if you want to donate if you're not already a patron if you want to donate to the fund to keep the full reaction library going the venmo going you can go to the links down in the description of the YouTube video, or you can go to the Patreon. It's $3 a month. You get full reactions as well as a whole bunch of other cool things. And um, yeah, I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace out.